Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 3011, where we have 24 moves to collect 8 popcorn. This looks monumental to me. I've got some blockers in the way, licorice, frosting, and then the cutouts here, and then actually these dispensers create problems. But I need the dispensers, obviously, because that's where I'm going to be getting my popcorn from. I need to get it produced, get it a little bit out of the way, and then get it popped. I'm hoping the bobbers will help me, but I've never seen the bobbers send fish that go after popcorn. I need to just open things up as quickly as possible. I'm taking out a lot of the, oh, hello, frosting first. So now we've got this, but we've got to find a way to pop it. I'm actually going to clear out a bit more here. It looks like it's a process of just making as much chaos on the board as possible. And when we do that, we will get the opportunities to get some specials created for us. Oh, I would love a color bomb wrapped combo. Can't quite get to it. I'm going to go ahead and just do this, which is going to hit these bobbers. Because it's a combo, it's going to send out more fish than normal. It'll also hit this, and it'll hit this, which will take out a color and concentrate things down. So it looks like the key here is I only have three colors on the board. That's what's making this possible. Well, it's making it more possible than if I didn't have three colors. I don't know if it's possible yet or not. We have to wait to find out. Let's blow this up and see if we'll get a lucky or candy to show up. We're not getting any more luckies here. So how can I get more luckies on the board? I guess I have to blow these up first. There's another lucky. Unfortunately, it's right under the dispenser, so it's hard to reach. But I have the feeling this is just going to go okay. The three colors are really helping me out. I think what I'm going to do is take out a color now, concentrate these colors down. So I took out green, and that gives me the opportunity to set this up with a special. And that should open up some of that popcorn. And then, of course, when the popcorn pops, it becomes a color bomb, and that helps further. I don't see how the fish are helping. But I'm not too worried now. Okay, so I'm going to bring down a Lucky. There was no Lucky that came down. Huh. I'm going to, going to get close to popping a popcorn. The fish does not go to the popcorn. There's my Lucky, but it's in kind of an awkward spot. Maybe the fish will help in popping the Luckies. I think they probably do, but actually I'm just going to open it this way. I'm exploring a bit, and because of that, I don't know that I'm playing extremely well. I want to pop that popcorn, so I don't want to move this aside. I'm going to do this instead. There we go. If I take out colors, then I'm hoping to get more wrapped candies to help out. See, the wrapped candies are really important for popping that popcorn once it gets created. Well, now I'm just going to sit back and watch this play solitaire. I like that. Well, I think this is going to help me to pop the two popcorn that are on the board. But, oh, no, or only one. But then I still need two more. I don't think I'm going to get it this time around, but I kind of don't mind because this has been an experience. I didn't expect the board to play like this. And so I'm kind of having fun just uh, learning about it. But let's go ahead and try again. And this time, now I know what to expect. So instead of working up here, I'm going to make moves low to the ground to encourage cascading. I'm going to try to open this up right away. There we go. Uh, yeah, I'll take that color bomb. I almost had tunnel vision and didn't see it because I was focused over here. But thankfully, I was able to take care of that. Okay, so I've still got to get this open, and it's not opening on its own. I still have some licorice on the board. Let's do that. Nice. So I've got more of these here, and I've got a perfect way to kind of take care of some of them. Plus, I'm taking out a color, which will concentrate things down. Nice. That's going to remove that. We've got a lot of things exploding, but we want this solitaire to occur. 
So the difference between last time and this time is I started lower to the ground. I thought it was important to remove that licorice, and now I've realized the licorice gets removed as I do other things. So I'm going to leave this intact for now. I'm going to bring down a lucky. I'm going to try to bring down another lucky, maybe, no. Well, and that got struck by the fish, but at least we've got a backup here. So we're getting more wrapped candies. So the fish just go after all of the specials, which isn't always that great. Now before I set this off, I want to bring more luckies onto the board, right? And set them off, but I can't reach green that way. Uh, well, I just kind of got rid of that opportunity. I was not thinking very clearly, was I? All right, so I'm going to take out all blue. It's going to open this up. Of course, it also concentrates the colors down, uh, so I can do more of this. And then I'm going to remove all green. And now I've got things I can put together. I could do this, but this is so much more explosive because it'll have the orange attacking more. I'm going to bring this orange down further. Now I'm going to do this, and it's really going to open up that popcorn, I hope. Wow, I expected it to do a bit more than it did. The new platform and the way the um, the color bomb wrapped candy responds to the new platform it's like it's extra heavy it's got this huge force of gravity on it and it pulls things downward so much all right so i can do this we only need three and we've got more than three on the board there we go there's two Okay, so what am I going to do? I'm going to take out green, and that should open up the last one that I need. With very little to spare, but it was still, I think, a fun ride. I hope that you enjoy this as much as I do. With only three colors, this is where you can practice making your specials if you need some practice in figuring out how to look for those uh, setups, those patterns. Although, really, you just have to wait and let the board play a bit of solitaire. If this was helpful, I'd ask that you consider liking and subscribing. That in turn would help me out. If you have any questions or comments, please put those below. And as always, thanks for watching.